So hey there, how are you doing? This is Kali from TechFans here. So last week we have installed the, the project uh, Pixel 2.0 on our uh, Redmi Note 10 Pro. So in this video, I will be uh, showing the impressions and uh, the uh, last one week water, whenever I was using water wall, water and all observation I have made, I will be sharing in this video. So let's get started. So first and foremost, we'll start with the build details. Like uh, this is the uh, latest uh, Pixel pro pro Project Pixel 2.0 with the Android 15. The security patch here we have is the April 5th, uh, 2025, which is the last month. The kernel here is 4.14.356. So the build date is uh, April 13, uh, 2025, which is almost uh, two weeks back. What are all the initial impressions I have uh, had uh, with this one? So uh, there are a few things which I actually liked about uh, this particular room. The first thing is the network monitor indicator. So uh, whenever uh, there is an internet is happening, you can see the uh, network speed in here. And you have the um, Google Play uh, services uh, integrity and safety net passed by default. So all the required banking apps uh, working uh, perfectly fine with this one. Also, you have the uh, dedicated uh, MIUI camera in here by default. So, uh, whichever uh, you had in your uh, uh, normal MIUI camera features, you will be getting it uh, here as well. So, that is one of the good part. You don't need to go ahead and install the G apps on this one. If you want to install G apps as well, you can install uh, as it has the camera PAP enabled by default. After that, you have the um, uh, Dolby Atmos uh, installed by default. So uh, the audio experience here is a bit uh, better uh, when compared to the OSS without the Dolby Atmos. And uh, you have the uh, dedicated gaming mode. So yeah, you have the game uh, dashboard option uh, where you can uh, have the FPS and all other things. So, so as we have uh, this option, I will be uh, doing the gaming review separately after this video it will be it will get uploaded i will be playing the bgmi so these are all some of the good things which i have uh, uh, noticed uh, when i was using it so i will talk about the battery a little bit so battery backup wise i'm getting as same as, 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 as the uh, mua i'm getting like a five and up to six hours of uh, uh, screen on time with this one and uh, the charging also it supports the uh, fast charging so it will be like uh, one and a half hour or one hour uh, 20 minutes it will just uh, charges the device fully so yeah so battery backup wise it doesn't have any issues there are some times uh, the, it, it, the device gets uh, warm up so but uh, that is fine i believe so now we'll see some of the tests which i have conducted so uh, does it support carrier aggregation yes it supports the uh, carrier aggregation like uh, i'm getting 2300 and 2300 and download and upload speed is almost the same as the miui so there is one there isn't any problem and in 3d wildlife uh, benchmark 3d mark wildlife you are getting the score of uh, uh, 11 12 and then the uh, average frame rate is uh, 6 point uh, uh, double six so which is almost same as the uh, MIUA and uh, you have the uh, uh, Geekbench score of uh, single core of uh, 634 and the multi score of uh, multi uh, score of uh, 1619 which is almost the same as the MIUA and you have the graphical score of 1305 which is also uh, same as the again the MIUA so uh, performance wise these scores are almost similar also the anti to benchmark also suggesting the same like i'm getting like 3 like uh, 16000 which is uh, almost same as the MIUA i have also run the uh, 15 minute uh, uh, stability uh, or uh, performance uh, testing so uh, this one uh, here it is having the 85 percentage of the uh, uh max performance i'm getting all the time and max performance here is higher when compared to the miua here i'm getting almost like uh, 1 lakh uh, 44 thousand barrels in uh, miua i'm getting like 1 lakh 37 thousand so performance wise this is one of the uh good one like uh, in terms of the uh, app opening and closing animation and then the um what uh, the app retention these are all uh, uh, just uh, great in my opinion. So I am just, I didn't feel any lag uh, whatsoever. Uh, only there are uh, positives. Well, there are some uh, negatives which I uh, have uh, seen. Like uh, in the, if you have, would have seen the installation video, you would have seen that uh, yeah, in the when we are doing the first screen uh, boot up, you we were uh, having some difficulties with navigating to the uh, setup screen. So that is one of the problem. That, but that problem didn't come uh, again. And uh, the another one is like 
I usually like the feature in uh, this uh, uh, free form like uh, you can uh, have the screen in here and uh, use the Instagram or something in the back end or uh, you can play um, what a podcast in the back end and uh, you can go through uh, something else in the other screen but i somehow enabled this through the uh, developer option this uh, free form but uh, when there is a free form opened you can't open you are unable to open any other app it is just uh, free form but uh, it doesn't enable you to use uh, some other app so this is uh, just uh, basically uh, useless so and uh, the security patch here also it is almost uh, old month because uh, we don't have the April uh, 5th security patch, so you will be, maybe in the future update, you will get uh, directly the May one. So that is one month old uh, security patch, it's not an issue. And uh, the other uh, problem that I uh, faced is like, uh, whenever uh, you open a YouTube video or something, and uh, you are uh, scrolling from uh, portrait to landscape, this particular nav bar just coming in the middle. So that problem was, I have seen it in, uh, other uh, Android 15 based uh, uh, ROMs as well. Here also that particular uh, uh, thing is happening. So only these are all the specific uh, problems happen. So other than that headphone jack, uh, Bluetooth, audio calling, all the things are uh, working as far as I have used. So if you are using, if you are someone using this uh, OS with this device, if you feel any problem that I have missed to uh, mention, uh, just uh, let me know in the comment section there isn't any major uh, features uh, which are uh, like uh, crazy features like you have written evaluation next like uh, changing the boot animation or something those kind of features are not there but at the same time uh, you are having a very very uh, useful uh, useful uh, features uh, which you need to move the day off so yeah thanks for watching so if you like the rome uh, review just leave a like and let me know your thoughts in the this one and i have uh, i will be making the next video of a uh, gaming review of this one so i will just uh, play in the pgme so it's not uh, much yeah watch previous videos here subscribe to here and code motor